Columbia's Citizens Police Review Board will no longer meet monthly. Thanks for joining us tonight. I'm Marissa Holloway. Lucas has the night off. ABC 17's Marina Diaz is live at Columbia City Hall tonight. And Marina, the board has been temporarily suspended following a series of pretty contentious meetings and the board's high turnover rate. Marissa, the board will no longer meet for its monthly meetings, but they will still review complaints. I spoke with chair member Rhonda Carlson to find out what happened and what's next for the board's future. Um, and we did receive a letter from the city councilor uh, telling us that until the, the city uh, council decides how and what we are going to do. We are just basically on hiatus until we have a um, uh, case. One month ago today, City Council voted to suspend Columbia Citizens Police Review Board. Rhonda Carlson sits on the Columbia Citizens Police Review Board chair, and she told me that there are a few reasons that led to this decision. I can't put my finger on one thing. Um, I think it's just the high turnover of uh, members. Since July, three members of the board have resigned. Carlson says she believes the city is reviewing candidates for the position during the board's hiatus. The board will still meet to review complaints, which is another thing that Carlson says they are not getting very many of. We don't have any complaints right now. If we were to get a complaint, obviously we would hear it. Carlson says complaints can be made through the city's website, the police department's website, or directly through the police department. If a complaint is made, the city will notify the board. A date and time will be scheduled when most of the members of the board can meet. Marissa, the board is still planning to continue to review complaints, like I said, and they are, uh, Carlson said that she is hopeful for the board's future. Reporting live in Columbia, Marina Diaz, ABC 17 News. Marina, thank you. And aside from COVID, earlier this week was the first monthly meeting the board has missed since the suspension was implemented.